in my thoughts. I shut it down wherever power is stored. Being real is in the past, watch the cowards get on, 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 on. It ain't kill me, so it's making me stronger. And these bite sized rappers now sets in my What the hell's going on, people? This is Periodic, and you see the title of the video. We are back with some, whew, not just some, a whole lot of news, information, uh, just things dropping left and right. I can't keep track of all of it. We're going to go into it right now because oh, if I went really in detail on all the stuff that's dropping both on Global and on Japan, this would be a 40 minute long video. I ain't trying to do all that. We're going to hit the high points. So <clears throat> starting tomorrow, Legendary Goku event will be dropping on Dragon Ball Z Dokken Battle. Global, fantastic. You have a chance of earning up to 35 stones, uh, five stones per uh, Goku, or no, five stones per uh, uh, time you beat it, if I remember correctly. You have to beat it seven times, or is it for every Goku you beat, it's, it's five stones. I can't remember. Either way, 35 stones total for defeating it. If we scroll down, the first comment by Zavari is pretty much alluding to that with this LR Goku um, event uh, came a banner where you got tickets um, was it tickets? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was tickets. And then you can use those to summon on an all Goku banner. And that banner um, had LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku on it. So you have the chance to pull an LR. Now, I've only ever pulled one LR on a ticket banner. It was the, um, and let me, let me rephrase that. On a ticket banner where you didn't use stones to receive tickets. Uh, I pulled an LR on the LR Vegito banner uh, back when it was LR Gogeta and Vegito. Uh, on, you know, the three plus ones, they gave you X amount of tickets. I was able to pull one Vegito on the tickets, but on just like freebie tickets, ones where they just give you for a celebration, I pulled LR Trunks on the guaranteed uh, animation banners. So that was a lot of fun. Hopefully my luck can come back because it's been gone for a few months now. Either way, we're going to move on from this. Um, we are pretty confident that tonight, 2.30 a.m. Uh, Eastern Time, which for me is going to be in a few hours from now. Actually, it's uh, going to be, whew, what, in, uh, yeah, uh, like probably like six hours or so. Um, uh, six hours, uh, eight hours. For me, it's going to be in about eight hours. Um, everything's dropping. The banners will be dropping for global. Obviously, we're going to have the transforming uh, Rage Goku here, Super Saiyan. We're going to have the new AGL Frieza that's going to be coming um, here as well, um, who's actually a pretty good AoE unit, if I remember correctly. And then the uh, free-to-play Frieza, who's going to get his own Extreme Z Awakening, second form Frieza. He's an AoE unit as well. He will become the best free-to-play AOE unit in the game, replacing the Intelligence Raditz. Um, and the Intelligence Raditz did do some work. If you guys go back into my videos, you'll be able to see a world tournament team that I put together where you did not have to use LR Broly or the physical uh, full power Broly. So it was usable with Intelligence Raditz. Gonna be even better for free-to-play players now with this um, second form Frieza, really showing that you don't necessarily need to have LR Broly to be able to climb the... Um, world tournament so this is going to be very very good great units uh let us move right along so uh second form uh easy a medals have been translated uh in the extreme z data but tech golden frieza isn't so um makes sense uh tech frieza didn't show up originally um around this time and i really don't know who the next easy a for global is gonna be janemba was the last one but we got that fairly late so they could really be mixing it up uh i, I have no idea who the next one is going to be um they've really been like you know throwing things out of order again namek saga goku was not supposed to be the next one you know um for global that would have been about three banners later um yeah just about three banners later so they're really mixing it up who knows who's the next eza we will find out very very soon um again uh, is dropping there you go october 3rd makes a lot of sense um again 35 stones up for grabs very very good uh, all these uh, events dropping new story event as well to final showdown with frieza that's going to be great and then the new doken event so you're going to get a few stones from the um final showdown with frieza do you get Dragon Stones for the free-to-play EZA? I don't think you do. Maybe for the missions? 
And then obviously you'll get two dragon stones for beating the Doken event, the Goku Doken event, um, which actually is fairly difficult at the end. Uh, so don't sleep on that. We'll be making a video doing, uh, you know, taking that on probably with a few different teams. Um, and then this is fascinating. So if we take a look at these Doken Festival tickets for Global, let's take a look at what they say. Doken Festival. So <clears throat> interesting because typically those um, Goku... Um, Tickets did not look like this on the Goku banner. So, and usually if it's a Doken Festival, it's speaking about the actual Doken Festival, not some ticket summon uh, celebration. So, I can only imagine that they're going to give tickets with every multi summon, or maybe like for the first three multis you get a ticket and that's it. I, I don't know. I can't remember who I was talking to about it on Twitter, but. I was saying that this might be a skip-worthy banner because there's not a lot of fantastic units, uh, you know, for this uh, for this Doken Festival. But if they're giving you tickets, that might creep up the value of it. So we'll find out very, very soon, but it's extremely interesting. So let's skip ahead. Uh, more maintenance has been announced on the 7th of October until the 8th. So that's very interesting. It's for a few hours, and we're actually not sure what that's going to be, most likely for a new update. That would be very nice, and as people are saying in the comments, it would be very good if we get the 9,999 item app update, because right now, you know, with some of these, like, uh, bubble medals and Gregory medals and stuff like that, I'm getting in the 800s and 900s after I've used a ton, and I do like to purchase them whenever they're in, like, the Baba shop and stuff like that. But it's like, once you start getting to eight, 900 medals, it's almost like, all right, I'm not going to use Baba points on this anymore because, you know, I'm just going to cap out real soon and then it's going to be a waste. So getting to that almost 10,000 item app limit, oof, that's going to be fantastic. So can't wait for that, um, or, or 10,000, you know, item limit, I should say. Okay, so that is pretty much the global news. You guys already know, we talked about it in my last video, Namek Saga Goku is fantastic. The AGL uh, Frieza is pretty darn good as well. The banner itself is not amazing, amazing. Uh, if you summon for it, good luck. If there's tickets on it, oof, that's tempting. Regardless, let us get off of global news and switch over to Japan. So, first thing is first, Super Saiyan Blue Cow Ken Goku has been announced. Uh, he, he will be receiving an Extreme Z Awakening, I should say. So, he's been announced. To receive an Extreme Z Awakening, uh, and his weakness will be the Universe 6 category, so that is very, very good news because I have this bad boy rainbowed, and I cannot wait to see how he will be. Obviously, they're going to have his own, um, you know, summoning banner. Uh, I believe it was like him. I forgot. It, it was actually listed in the news. I'll probably take a look at that in a second. Yeah. So here's the banner right here. Actually, it's the AGL. Uh, Kao Ken Blue Goku, and then Super Saiyan 3 Broly, so not great, not, not great at all, to be quite honest. Um, if we're taking a look at some other stuff here, uh, just things that are going to be in the news, uh, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks is coming back, which is fine. We're going to have some Dokken events that are up uh, as well with a few other, um, you know, a uh, few other story events and things of that nature. Um, Universe 6 Summon is coming back, makes sense. Uh, we're going to have some missions, which we'll talk about in a second. Uh, LR Blue Vegito will be having a legendary campaign, which is going to be huge. That is very, very important uh, because I, I would say most people have this man rainbowed already. I actually still don't on Japan. I do on Global. I'm actually working on a second copy uh, to have his TUR rainbowed, but uh, it's pretty rough. Um, Intelligence Trunks is actually receiving a... Um, Interesting enough, he's actually receiving an EZA area. So if we take a look at here, um, yeah, this boy is getting, um, you know, the EZA treatment. And it's going to be that new game mode like they did with the uh, Goku, Gohan, and Trunks Vegeta characters. Where it's going to be very limited amount of characters that you can bring. Um, should be a lot of fun. Dragonstone's up for grabs. All that great stuff. And then... Um, so yeah, that's that's that there. Um, 4.6.0 update is incoming is for Japan. Very interesting, uh, mainly because this doesn't really tell you much. Like it's just a little picture of like swapping back and forth, and you're kind of just like, okay, okay, what does that mean? 
So if we take a look at uh, the Homi Goresh's translation on here for the 4.6.0 update for Japan, we have uh, there's going to be a button to sell all Mr. Satan statues at once, which is going to be really, really cool because there's sometimes where you have, you know, 10, 15, 20, 25, you know, Hercule statues, and it's going to be super helpful just to click one button get rid of all of them uh, because at this point it's just kind of annoying to select every single one so nice little quality of life change uh you can reverse a unit from their growth tab so that's going to be pretty fascinating um you can swipe uh from left to right in the treasure section of the baba shop oh, okay so i see what that is so typically you have to go to the top and hit the little tab the right or left tab to be able to switch back and forth now you can just swipe left and right okay that's fine that's that, that actually makes sense new summon animations nani and then you can use the label system in battlefield so obviously there's been a lot of um unearthed uh summoning animations super saiyan cow ken uh, super saiyan blue cow ken um, we haven't seen any Gogeta summon animations, but I'm sure that they have some stuff labeled. Um, maybe they're going to add a skip uh, animation button, kind of like how they have on Legends. That would be very fascinating. I would really like if they just add a number so you know which <laughs> which number you're on. You know, the first card, second card, third card, etc., etc. So that's going to be super, super interesting. Okay, so if we go back down here, so yeah, that's it right there, just swiping left to right. Um, let's get out of there. Uh, Japan Data Download. So this obviously came out uh, yesterday. A ton of new cards coming. Um, you have the TUR... Uh, super intelligence new Gohan who's apparently very very strong transformation looks super dope as you can see here though we still are missing the one armed Gohan it is what it is did I say Goku I'm, I'm almost positive I said Gohan but either way TUR future Gohan there he is TUR Super Saiyan trunks with the Saiyan armor who looks very very cool even his uh his normal form looks cool as well. I like that. So he's also a very good card. Uh, you're going to have a free-to-play uh, Tech 17 who TURs into this bad boy right here. And I really do mean bad boy because they're, they're, you know, he's not a nice guy. And then free-to-play uh, SSR 18 as well, TURs into this one here. They're also very decent uh, pretty good, you know, free-to-play units. There they are right here. And then uh, free-to-play uh, physical Gohan who, you know, goes up or, or awakens from this boy who's got a fan. I, lo I always love this card art. It's actually really, really cool. So this is uh, the UR for this Gohan right here, Super Saiyan Gohan. Uh, again, not bad of a card at all. So let's get out of there. Um, I may, I don't know if I'll go over all of them. Uh, in another video uh, i'm sure you guys probably already know what their stats are but regardless uh mission translates or mission translations for all out training celebration in jp so this is going to be starting uh, tomorrow complete a training five times equals 50 medals awakening of all types complete a training seven times three uh kaioshin medals uh, z awaken three characters 200 potential orbs of all types z awaken five characters two sleepy kais or dozy kais Doken Awaken, one character, one Dragon Stone. Uh, open 50 hidden potential, uh, you know, paths or uh, orb sockets. 450 potential orbs of all types. Open 100 potential orb sockets. Uh, you get one Timeless Hourglass. Raise Super Attack, one time 50 Metal Awakenings of all type. Raise three uh, Super Saiyan three. Um, uh, raise three Super Attacks, uh, three Metal Kao Shin. Raise uh, Super Attack five times, one Dragon Stone. Complete a stage without taking damage three times. You get one platinum turtle shell of all type. Complete a stage in two minutes or less. Five times you get some special keys. Complete a stage without normal attack or counter three times. Complete a stage without normal attack or counter. Okay, interesting. Three times special keys. So you just have to do super attacks. Complete a Doken event equals one Sleepy Kai. Complete a Doken event three times. Three Sleepy Kais. Complete a Doken event five times, one Dragon Stone. Complete an easy A level equals three Sleepy Kais. Uh, use 300 stamina, 450 potential orbs of all types. Use 500 stamina, one Elder Kai. Complete 10 missions, three Dragon Stones. Complete all missions, five Dragon Stones. And then you have the revamped Fight Against Despair story event. So you have to complete all stages on normal, Z hard. Complete three, four, five, and six Z hard stages. Uh, Doken Awaken, Gohan Future. 
uh, Dokken Awakens, free to play 17, free to play 18, and you'll get uh, two Dragon Stones off of this. You'll have um, uh, SSR Tech, Go on Future SR, uh, Trunks SR Intelligence, 18 SSR Strength, one Hercule Gold, uh, or actually three Hercule Gold statues, so that's for everything. Uh, mission Daily missions, complete a stage two times, one are Hercule Silver. I like how it's, this is for Japan, but they said Hercule, that's fun. Use 25 stamina, one Z sword of all type, complete a stage from training section, uh, 25 metal awakenings, all type, complete all daily missions, one extra dragon stone. Mission weekends, complete any stage, complete uh, any stage two times, three times, four times, five times, you get three dragon stones and three sleepy kai's. So there's that. If we X out of here, master in the student category has been added into the game. We do not need to translate that. Quite a few units, as you can see, a ton of Trunkses, Piccolos, Roshis, Gohans, some TNs, some Super Saiyan Blue Goku, some Super Saiyan Blue Vegetas, some Kid Gokus, some Beeruses, some Weeses. Um, what else do you have? Some Oobs, uh, Yamchas, <laughs> Champas are there. Uh, who else is out here that I'm not seeing? Yeah, Young Gohans, Tien Chaozus, more Piccolos, more Beerus. Um, uh, just a lot of good cards. A lot of good cards, so that's very good for us. And last but not least, they did indeed add a final copy of Frieza in the um, you know Battlefield Shop, the Ultimate Class Shop. 300,000 Battlefield Memories. Um, I'm out here just trying to awaken 18, who's actually really good. I awaken Krillin first. But 18 is actually really good. I'm trying to awaken her first. So I'm just trying to work my way up to getting 30 of those uh, awakening medals from Battlefield Memory. And then I'll start saving for LR, King Cold, and Frieza. Um, but that's about it, guys. That is everything that's coming out in the next few days, tonight and the next few days, for Dragon Ball Z, Dokken Battle, Global, and Japan. Let me know if I missed anything. Let me know what you are looking forward to the most. And while you are thinking about that, while you are contemplating that, make sure you're gently rubbing that subscribe button, gingerly ringing that bell button, essentially kissing the like button. As always, this is Periodic. See y'all in the next video.